Hey guys, this is Stephen Howard, my dog Yucca. I don't know if you can see that beam, but pretty rad. The sunbeam. I'm out here in Level Canyon, and uh, wanted to talk about some pretty heavy subject. It it came to me this morning. It has to do with family and uh, has to do with, um, you know, the Thanksgiving that's coming up. And it's been a hard year. 2020 has been a hard year on everybody. Just wanted to show you some of the rock out here. It's uh, pretty prehistoric. A lot of fossils. Uh, I'm at the mountain top. So this would be the top of a... Uh, bottom of an ocean. You actually find shells out here in the rocks. Another example. And there's a lot of energy in the rocks out here. Um, but um, back to family. Um, you know, we're all having get togethers. Some people are invited, some people are not. Uh, there's various reasons for that. And it's all, you know, understood and uh, all of that. But I, I think that, um, you know, those, those things can change and those relationships can change and people can come together with understanding and uh, love and, and happiness for the holiday season. Um, however, you know, some families can't get together because somebody is incarcerated or somebody uh, has some sort of issue and so that prevents people from getting together you know at least you can reach out at least you can uh, talk to one another reach out send a message send a text uh, just try and be the the bigger person in the situation wish everybody a happy holiday um, you know, my own family, um, I always felt kind of like the black sheep or, you know, the one that didn't come up to, to standard or snuff. And come to find out my brother is having problems with the law and um, keeps repeating the same style of, of offenses. And I'm starting to see a pattern and it makes me real sad for my brother. So... Uh, if everybody would pray for uh, him this holiday season. Um, where I was going with this is uh, you can change. You know, everybody can change. Um, I've had plenty of hard times, plenty of times where I made the wrong decisions or did something wrong in uh, the public's eye and... Um, you know, I, I've atoned for those things. I've changed my path. Uh, I actually was talking to my new probation officer yesterday. And uh, really nice guy. I wanted him to know why I was a criminal. You know, most people are trying to explain why they're not a criminal. Uh, I'll explain to you why I'm a criminal. So um, uh, I, I've had a lot of hardship in my life, um, even though I came from a wealthy background. And um, I've had to kind of like grow and learn from all of those situations and even become street smart and uh, become world smart. And that's why I'm out here is because uh, I like to isolate myself and just be one with nature uh, enjoy the beauty of the mountains and uh, juniper berries are all ready for harvest. Uh, I wish I had a press. We'd have some juniper oil. But um, yeah, it's uh, it's been a long, long journey for me. Uh, spiritual path. And uh, like these rocks, you know, I wonder how many years it took for each one of these coral uh, levels to grow you know if that's like rings of a tree then how long did that take and you can see there's actually shells 
in the rock. It's a pretty amazing rock. That's the problem. You want to you wanna collect all the rocks out here, and you just can't. That would be too much stuff. But uh, it's fun to look at, and I love the geology of the area. Uh, my downloads lately have been that uh, something's coming that you don't realize. Something really big. It will touch your heart in such a way that you won't be able to show uh, the gratitude until maybe a few days later. Um, there's something so big coming for you that it's going to change your entire way that you're living your life and um, things are going to come full circle. You're going to feel as though life has, has reached uh, some sort of new level and that uh, you're actually aspiring and manifesting your dreams, um, whatever they are. And that goes for love, business, finance, everything. That everything's getting a re-makeover and you're getting lost chances. Uh, chances that came around before but you weren't ready. And now you've reached a different level. So people recognize that and they realize the value in that. And maybe they're willing to back you up on a few things. Um, so... That being said, um, I'll let you guys go. I, I've uh, had a great morning. I uh, got a, a little meeting with a CBD company later today for a job interview, so wish me luck there. Um, I always have big ideas. Uh, they're attainable, but you have to realize a big idea takes little baby steps uh, in order to make it there. And uh, I try and live one day at a time and keep my vibration high. Uh, speaking of vibration, frequency shift a couple of days ago. And uh, I actually felt the frequency shift. And I heard the pitch or the, the tone change and go to a little bit higher level. So... I might be at 12 or 13,000, maybe 14,000 megahertz now on the frequency that I pick up on. And the messages are coming even faster. And so I'm having trouble paying attention. Sometimes I wake up in the middle of the night and that is my guides. Uh, my guides actually speaking to me. There's a little bit of quartz on top of this rock. Well, I hope you guys have a great day. Uh, I'm just exploring the bottom of the ocean here in Lovell Canyon. And uh, I hope you guys will get out and explore your own area and see what there is to discover. Have a good day, guys.